Alright gamers, we have a whole bunch of brand new stuff for Dokkan right now. It is so crazy. It's last night was so freaking crazy. I can't even explain what happened. I have something to talk about in this video. It is freaking not how much Dokkan... This is probably honestly easily Dokkan's best celebration in all of history. Like this really is like I can't even compare stone counts like on JP and Global because Global has way more now. I think now we're getting over 200 stones because we have a whole bunch of brand new a whole bunch of new easy that just came out on JP and I'm really glad they pushed them a lot early so and it was just last night for Dokkan blew up. It was nuts so I'm still kind of taking my time with it, but it's so much info right now. It's so much craziness today. But yeah, let's go ahead and get right and get started though, because again, I, I can't even explain it. Like, this is Dokkan's easily best celebration from the part one with all of the, all of the freaking, you know, the discounts. Like, you know, you buy one, get one free, but during the second round of the buy one, get one free, you get a feature unit. Part two had the tickets, so we summon on the banners, you get tickets, and you can summon on duplicate version of the banner with tickets. And then part three, of course, is the same thing, where you just use rainbow tickets from the missions you got from part one and two and three. Like, from the whole entire nine-year anniversary, you do all the missions, you can use those tickets to summon our duplicate banner, which we see on JP. And, um, yeah, glad it made part three, because we definitely didn't need it. Um, and the EX part's pretty much kind of feeds in here as well, because of the big thank you, so... I'll probably get to zone short because that's when we'll get the part one and two wallpapers. So we just can do missions, get the part one and two wallpapers with Berlin and Gogeta, then like the part two with superheroes. So that should be it's definitely its own wallpaper though and its own thing. But yeah, holy crap, it is it zones right now for global. It's, like I said. And then you know, with part three, again, all the new stuff that's coming out. Like I said, if you combine all this, this is easily as global's best celebration. Best summons in the game. Honestly, I say best summons in Dokkan existence, honestly, right now. Best summons, best characters, best easy A's, best you like this is literally global's best celebration ever. Like in general, for Dokkan, for even anything on JP, even UI Goku, I wanna say. I feel like this this definitely I know it's anniversary level anyway, because it's supposed to be crazy and hype, but they went overboard and I loved it. They went above and beyond, they went overboard and I loved it all. It's so freaking good. It's Again, I'm gonna make a whole video breaking down like the whole anniversary. Like, just I'm gonna geek out over part like everything that came out, the new anniversary units. Again, I do this for both Global JP. Next year, I'm gonna do it um, after the anniversary is finished because you know ten years gonna be synced up at this point. So pretty much after the anniversary ends, like when today actually ends, I'm gonna make a full video and thoughts on everything. I usually do it for down celebration as well because those are like is it like I said one of the biggest the anniversary down celebration are the biggest in Dokken. Ten of all, I don't really do it though, just because I mean I say everything I need to say anyway. So. Um, but yeah, um, let's go ahead and get started though. We have a whole bunch of new stuff, of course. So the Supreme Battle Spectacle finally got a new banner, honestly. Uh, but, <laughs> honestly, it finally got a new banner. Again, right now it's just so much info, like I'm, I can't take it. It's crazy right now, I love it. Um, voice a little bit out of it though, because I got some really good sleep, so I'm still kind of waking up my voice a little bit. So for Super Bosses and Superheroes, they pretty much, um, they added, uh, Supreme Battle Spectacle, Summit Banner, pretty much for all Dragon Ball Super heroes and villains so pretty much like so super heroes super bosses pretty much those two categories kind of came together in one big banner you can get characters for like you can struck ball super characters lrs this is the regular ticket summon banner when you summon on it um you don't have to beat the missions to get tickets so you can summon the banner and of course you have the gs star i'm saving them though. i always like to save these just in case if they add something new to the banner i like it of course for the right here guy brand new eza he seems to pretty okay nothing too crazy um, same goes for Beerus, he yeah, also a brand new easy, ain't nothing really crazy there. Again, just it's just it's just whatever. And then of course for his event is back but he actually get EX deal with for him. I think Beerus can do the same thing as well for his event. I couldn't really find it on here. But um yeah though, I'm I'm excited about that too. It's really really awesome and cool. Uh of course a nine year battle, of course you get EX equipment just you know, probably for I think for like the new, new units like like Burly and Beast, you can get equipment for them. Um but like I say you do get Pacific equipment for I think Pacific units. Big gold, bronze, and of course silver. Um, about like good, just like just uh, like I said, the anniversary units. Um, it tells you like all the weaknesses and what they do and everything. Of course, to see like I said, skill orbs, stones. I uh, heard the events are really easy though, which makes sense though. Again, for a challenge event, it does make sense just because you know, again, a lot of them are just easy nowadays because all the new units we have in the game. But yeah, then you, the now your Dark Confess have been added again. Only beats in Broly War, Dark Confess, Gamma, Good Year, or Carnivals, which I was kind of confused. Was it come shockingly to add them? But I mean, we could get a Carnival battle at one point. I said it could be a down celebration thing, you know, bring in some Carnival units, you know, um, Goku, like Super Saiyan Goku. Um, physical cooler, you know, give us a carnival version of this, that'd be fun. 
a little bit difficult, but of course, um, gotta do superhero, of course. Um, title right here, Special Beast Cannon, looks awesome and cool. Of course, Gamma, um, two sacrifices pretty much. Um, a new support memory now when you do the new Swim Battle Spectacles. Yeah, because you fight Gogeta, Beast, and of course, some, some Trunks. I know Trunks is a really crazy opponent. I think Gohan can hit a little bit hard and think Gogeta as well, but I think Trunks is probably like one of the most fearsome ones, I believe. Because he can, he can start hitting hard a little bit later, though, because they want you to start building up, though. But yeah, new support memory and, of course, a new um, title. So, I'll probably get on that at some point. The superhero um, event, superheroes for tomorrow event is back, though. Of course, now you can get exclusive skill orbs. Um, I think it's pretty much it, though, I think they added. Um, if I go to the trunks, the team go to the trunks in the movie. Get EX skill orbs, you can get more Kai's that look like in the shop now. So, that's really, really good. I'm going to start probably grinding that out on stream. I use super bosses and use superheroes for each category drops, etc., etc. So yeah, of course. Um, again, this is obvious here. Uh, so we get a special friend summon. It was leaked already from uh, Rick, so they get him. Uh, friend Twitter. Um, he did mention that. I'm um, pretty much forget like again. You get grand kai's, you get other kai's from the, just the, the it's just a fan banner. Um, now you just get kai's and um, grand kai's from it though. It's up for a limited amount of time. So yeah, just make sure you know how to do it. Well, you can. Again, they're really really easy. Of course, and all the LRs that are. Friend summon exclusive, which is did have shit like a Jero and 19 on there. Or, you know, Dallas Operation bringing a new LR in this once in a while. But then you get other SSRTR and LRs too. This is gonna be, this is a grind right here. But yeah, uh, I, 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 of course, we got some new nine year missions as well for part three. Um, of course, Gogeta is still easy as if you haven't got them already. Um, yeah, you get Dragonstone, Skill Orbs, Large, and more mission stuff I need to see. Yeah, you do, yeah. Part one mission complete. Part two missions complete. Part three. Da, da, da. Yeah, it's pretty much it kind of right there. Of course, now it's on to the info. The best part, probably the celebration. Again, this is Global's. In, in general, this is just Doken's best celebration ever. Like this really is. Like if you down celebration from last year, which I think was probably the hypest one from Blue Vegeta and Tomasu, we had again Tenabata, which probably was really amazing this year too. So many good like this this year for Doken, they really stepped it up. I'm really glad though. In general, like they did really really good. So yeah, let's go ahead and get started. Again, July is always the biggest and craziest month. But yeah, next month, um, during this time, down celebration. So we're probably gonna get the leaks around like usually here through VJP. We'll see the pilot, like the login unit, the new gimmick for the um uh, down celebration. Then right here is usually like, you know, leaks and stuff like that. Of course, the app icon. Uh, a little bit more of like, you know, leaks and you know, whatever um is gonna come out probably then then right here's just countdown, then this is when when it, when it starts. So yeah. Um but the first week of August usually is kind of dead though for both Global and JP. So, but at this point though, Global and JP can be synced up. So we're gonna if Global's gonna be dead, JP's gonna be dead uh, soon enough. Like in in general, like if they get those type type of dry spells, um, you know, Global will be dead, JP will be dead at the same time. You know, um, in general, like the game sync up. So yeah, let's go ahead and get started though. Of course, but yeah, uh, we have a whole bunch of brand new stuff here. So of course, we got of course part three missions. Of course, we got the um, tickets you can still get from you know, part three. Uh, we got new missions so you can get tickets. You can sell on the banners uh, for bees for all the pretty much nine year anniversary units. Oh, new easy A um support campaign. So yeah, that's good though. That's more zany for you guys if you need it. Spring Battle Spectacle got a brand new tickets um, banner, so that's really really good. This is all I'm talking about right here. So in part three, like I said, you get these tickets just from doing missions for part one, two, and three, and then you can summon on any banner of these you want to with these tickets you have. As long as you have the tickets, you can do at least summon. So if you're still missing Broly, still missing Gogeta, still missing B, still missing Gammas, you know, go ahead and do it. Um, they, these are worth it though. But like I said, I probably say Gogeta or no, honestly, I probably say yeah. Uh, a lot of people thinking like a B, like I was thinking Gogeta. I don't know why, but I probably say B and Broly if you don't have them yet, or you know, you still want to get duplicates. I think this is the best idea to do it though. I think Gogeta, then Gammas will be last. I feel like a lot of people say you can still summon a Gogeta, but like I said, I think Broly and Beast are probably going to be better, though. In my opinion, though, I think you definitely should go for that, though. Because, again, yeah, they're still some of the best units in the game, and they're still freaking disgusting, though. So, yeah. Of course, get a special Nightmare summon. Of course, you can get Otakaichi from summoning on the banner. Uh, you like Goku. You like Goku and Evolution Blue Vegeta's easy A is still one of the best easy A's in the game, easily. Jiren's events back though, so you can, um, every day, so you can, um, oh, it's a burst mode, okay, that's what it was. Uh, cause I know Frieza, I think, had a burst mode, I think it's still up though, might have ended already? Yeah, I think it ended, cause Jiren's sub. Um, uh, good basement added to the Dragon Ball Super Universe 7 Edition easy A area. Frieza been added to the Wicked Ball and Free to Play easy A area. Um, Story Events been updated, so you can get Skull for Frieza. Oh okay, yeah, that beer's had one stage for that. I guess not. Superhero event um has been updated though. Like I just said, um, updated and skill orbs, more to guys. 
Uh, nine Year Battle with Beast and Broly, or uh, a Spin Battle Spectacle with Gogeta, Beast, and um, um, Trunks are up as well. What else? What else? What else? What else? What else? Oh, Philip, Philip Beckham is. Yeah, they all just story, movie story events with Bardock. Well, movie slash special story events with you know, Bardock, Kaki and Goku and Slug, which I wish we had done at some point. Uh, movies edition. Uh, yeah, easy area. More um, titles you can get. Oh, yeah, this event too. I kind of forgot about this. Um, I always forgot about this. Uh, yeah, you get missions. To, okay, look like you just get dark souls from his missions. I think you get skull from it though, but they get limited attempts. You can do it one a day. So yeah, just uh, it's a superhero's new um, determination. But yeah, um, I guess you, you just get dark souls from this event. I can't remember right now. Let me actually open that real fast. Yeah, I checked it. They're just missions. Nothing really crazy in there, honestly. So yeah, you can just do this. You know, get down and stuff. So yeah, nothing really crazy there. Oh yeah, new movie red zones with um, Bojack, Slug, and Burly. I think right. But yeah, then now you can get, get into support memory with Gamma. So, yeah. Uh, so, Max is getting a new difficult event as well. So, oh boy. Yep, he's back. He's back. Oh, yeah. the um, This is pretty much the EX part right here. Pretty much the maximum thanks. So, pretty much, like I said, on the 8th. Pretty much almost the last day of the anniversary. It's gonna... Oh, yeah. That was the wrong thing. Yeah, I, I, was, I was looking at here, down here. But yeah, uh, right here is pretty much the... Um... Um, pretty much thank you for everybody, everything for, like, for the anniversary and everything. So, we're gonna get like Dragonstones, you know, the part one and two wallpapers. Again, that's always near the end, we're end of the anniversary though. So, make sure to get that when you can. Um, which will be get yeah, next Thursday pretty much at this point. So, yeah, that'll be in the next week. So, pretty much like I say, get, we're gonna get the part one wallpaper, the part two wallpaper, um, you know, more stones and stuff like that, of course, you know, orbs and stuff. So, pretty much like I said, big thank you for the anniversary. This, this honestly, I can't even hold back. This is freaking nuts. So, the first of all, the saga is getting, you know, a little um, banner right here. So, when this banner came out for JP, we thought they were going to get easy, which was confirmed. And now it's really confirmed. These three are getting easy as on global, which is freaking nuts. They're next Thursday, too. Holy crap. So, next week's easy A's. Okay, we get three best easy A's, like three amazing top 10 easy A's in the game right here. Because the Golden Freeze and 17 are amazing. This 17 is a freaking monster with the Universe 7 support, and this guy is just, you know, you know, you know, because the new journey just came out on JP, of course. Obviously, they, oh, actually, they could probably release them early on Global if they wanted to. They could just release Jiren here if they really wanted to. to give them, they can do it a lot better. Because I, I feel like Cell Max might be in here. I don't know yet. But, um, this shocked me, though. So I was like, um, because everybody thought they were going to bring these guys early for Global anyway. It just makes sense, you know, with this theme being Dragon Ball Super for the anniversary. So it does make sense. But I did not think they actually do this. I didn't think they would actually would freaking do this. That is nuts. I was like, holy crap! It just pop popped up at every like it popped up last day. I'm like, do you got one? Can I keep myself spo uh, spoiler free you know, for the celebration? Cause I'm doing that now. But it's freaking nuts. We got three goodies in. So we got uh, Team Universe Seven with Int Seventeen. We got Physical Golden Freeze on Seventeen and Tech Jiren and Easy A's all at the same time. On the eighth, that's good though. I mean, I get why they did because you know the global sync and everything, but I'm glad they brought them early. Again, they easily could have brought like you know, I mean, they could have just dropped Temple in here. You know, no one would have cared. Um, they bring like Roshi, you know, after down celebration. They could have. They just, just like here's another Dark Confess, by the way. <laughs> have fun. Um, that would, that would obviously would have been really funny, but yeah, I'm, I, I mean, I'm glad they did it though. But I didn't expect them to actually do it. Like, I, I had a feeling they were going to do it not too surprising, but like, what in the world? Let's go definitely go cool. again. Best celebration of Doken. Okay, this is the film right here. Yeah, so pretty much like Frieza appears with get EX yeah, skill orbs. I knew it was in here somewhere. I can find it. Um and that's just all part two stuff. I guess when Cell Max was in here. Maybe it was just a banner. I keep thinking Cell Max's banner was in here. Maybe because it was Where where was it? I I lost it already. So Max event. Because I thought he was coming to Global early. That's why I thought this was here. I'm like, is Cell Max coming early to Global? I, I mean I wouldn't be surprised, but yeah, I mean, this is the first time Global really ever changed up an anniversary because adding these three is something JP didn't do at all. So maybe they had this, and maybe deep down they had this originally planned. But holy, crap, they're dropping three good, t t good tier easy A's, like top tier easy gate, t 10, 20 easy A's in the game right now. So yeah, again, I got nothing else to say. Like this is, I, I'm so freaking emotionally drained out right now. Like I have no, I have so, it's, so much stuff happened like this week, so much crap, but. Again, we get what? One, two, three, four, five. Five freaking LREZAs. And <laughs> what's the celebration? What are they doing? Ah! Like, and then we got tickets right here. Then you got more tickets. We need someone on the banner. Like, come on, man. Like, 
I have nothing else to say. This is just, <laughs> I just it's it's nuts. I love it though. It's so crazy. It's, I love it all. But holy crap, they 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 they, they, they really went overboard. And I loved it all. It's it's crazy right now. I love it. But yeah, together though, of course, thank you so much for watching. If a great day, great life, I'll go check again. Make sure I stay safe, wash hands, cup us all of you. Going up and wear a bath, so top people are easy to get back to can. Go outside, just got season cooking. I'm sure all my friends are just go so terrific. Where you guys are awesome, we get the cabal. So, of course, like to hit it again. Very simple, very easy, like I said, today. Lots of craziness, lots of love for Doken right now. Best celebration in Doken. No contest. But yeah, see you guys later, though, okay, though. Peace out.